Hi, my name is Brian Davis. I'm a physician assistant for Dr. Peter Millett here at the Stedman Clinic in Vail, Colorado. Today we're going to address some of the most commonly asked post-operative questions. If you have undergone arthroscopic shoulder surgery, you will have a series of small portals. There will be one in the front, two on the side, and one in the back. There may be a variation of these portal placements. If you undergo bicep tenodesis, you will have a small incision in your axilla. This incision, as well as your portals, will be closed interoperatively with dissolvable sutures. However, the axilla suture will need to be trimmed at two weeks post-op. All of the incisions will be secured with Steri-Strips. The Steri-Strips should stay on for two weeks. On post-operative day one, we will replace your surgical dressing with opsites. You will be provided with a 10 to 14 day supply of opsites. When applying the dressing, you will notice there is a one and a two on the opsite. Simply remove side one and place over as many portals as possible. Then remove side two, which leaves a flexible watertight dressing. These should be changed every other day. At your two week post-op appointment, the Steri strips over your portals should be removed. There are no sutures to be removed. They are absorbable. Your bicep tenodesis incision will also be closed with absorbable sutures. However, the ends will need to be trimmed. To do this, simply locate the ends of the suture. You may need to remove some Steri strips to find these. The suture looks like clear fishing line material. To trim, simply pull the suture taut and cut at the level of the skin. This will be repeated at the other end of the incisions. The Steri strips can also be removed at this time. Please contact our office if you are experiencing any of the following. Excessive drainage from the incisions, redness around the incisions, fever or shortness of breath, uncontrollable pain, or excessive swelling in your forearm or hand. We hope you found this video helpful. Please contact us with any questions or concerns.